Hello everyone, it's Fishy. Today we're going to be building the BR Class 08. It's a more simpler locomotive than the one we did in the last episode, but it's mostly because I'm just too lazy to do any of the other big steam locomotives I'm working on. So without further ado, let's let's get started on Diesel from Thomas and Friends. That's probably what most people know this locomotive from. So first thing you're going to want to do is on your rail here, Go ahead and just skip back three blocks, and we're just going to place our wheels first. It's just easier, in my opinion, for uh, my design I've built for this locomotive. So, six in total, and three, uh, two, and over two. I'm not sure if this is a two by two. I think it's a two by two. Anyway, um, then we can place our stairs. So you're going to stack two stairs on top of each other like this, uh, right outside the, the first set of the wheels here. Like that. And then you're going to place a row of the stairs upside down. Across, that's not right. Don't do that. Cr uh, don't do that either. Cross like this. There we go. You want that, not what I did twice in a row. But make sure they're upside down and across like this. And now we can start really working off... Um, the rest of that. This is the base. So go ahead and place a row of slabs on top like this. And uh, yeah, do out two more like that. So we'll go like this. Out two. And then we can cover this up front here and then bring it on top back like this. So, out to, have it extend out to here. And then, yeah, let's do that. We'll put the, uh, this, I'm not totally sure why this locomotive has it. I haven't really looked into it. Um, but it has this rod on the side. So we'll go ahead and place that out of slabs. Like that. You don't want it too high because then it'll merge with the slab. You want it in between. And... If you're using the texture pack I have, um, normally I would probably just make uh, the stone slabs that I'm using out of granite because granite is like a really nice uh, smooth black in this texture pack. Um, but I know not everybody has this texture pack, so you just use stone, simple stone or cobblestone. Uh, that works as well. So now what we'll do is we'll start building uh, from the front to back. So I'm going to be using black, but you really can use any color. Um, and it's going to build it up three blocks, and we'll start from there. So we're going to go back to the last set of driver's wheels. It's just going to build a three by three box rectangle of sorts, like this. And we're pretty much halfway done. And now we can cover the top for the, for the time being that and then we will start working on the cab and then we'll go in and get uh, details after so for the cab you're going to want to make this shape so you're going to place two blocks leave a space here and then wrap it all the way around like this and then bring it down so kind of, I don't know what you want to call this shape no, but it's just going to come around and then stop and leave a leave a space for the door and the window and let's do that on the other side as well. Like this. There we go. Now, now that we have the first part of the cab here, we're going to place the back as well. So you're going to connect both of these like this, and then leave two blocks like this for the rear windows. And then we'll uh, place two blocks here for your ladders that and you just connect that oops come on let me in there there we go and then we can finish out the cab placing some slabs like this and then we'll get we'll get to this in a bit and then back here we will place a row of upside down stairs like that and down here I'm gonna place two slabs like this just to kind of give it some depth bring it together um, now, 
to cover the, the roof here with your slabs. So it's going to be four by three. Uh, you don't want to go any farther than the than the than what the cab sticks out. All right. And now I think we can really start going into the details. So grab a ladder, and we're going to place a ladder one back from the stairs. Let's place it up like this, and then to the cab as well. And then on the sides here, you're going to place two on top of each other, skip one between the ladder and this, and then you're going to place two flat like this. So you should have something like this. There you go. We're going to come back onto the top, and we're going to place some trap doors of your choosing. I'm going to use, personally, I'm going to use oak place one there and then you're gonna place two down here and then skip one break a hole fill it and place a brick wall of your choosing I'm just gonna use stone I think it looks the best um, and another thing if you're making the if you're making this in a different color other than black um, let's just say you're gonna use I don't know. Green, I know, is one from Thomas. So you would place black in between the areas like this uh, if it was out of a different color. So there'd be two black spots right there, I believe. Um, but if you're just making it black, don't worry about it. Now we'll come to the, the front of the locomotive and you're going to grab some buttons and we're going to place three on the bottom like this and then grab a torch for your headlamp and place it up top like that now we'll come back to the cab and inside probably what we can do you can do anything you want in here but I'm going to place three upside down um, stairs like this and then I'm going to grab a lever and just put it in the middle see there it is lever I'm not gonna put any seats there's there just really isn't a room in here um, grab a glass of your choosing I'm gonna be using tinted glass place your glass in the glass areas that we've made so one here next to the doors and then two back here and then grab a door any door you want I'm gonna be using an iron door like that And then, I think, we're going to wrap it up here. Grab a redstone torch and an item frame. And you're going to place a marker light right here. And then I believe I used, yeah, item frames as, like, buffers. So, that should be it. Let's see. Again, it's, a, it's just a very simple um, locomotive to build. It's nothing crazy. They're very small. Um, in general, I think they're used to be switchers more than haulers. But that is going to be pretty much it. The next episode, I think I'm going to be building this F40PH 2CAT uh, NJ Transit, I believe. It actually turned out pretty nice. So I think I'm going to be doing that one in the next episode. And then I've got two steam locomotives. Um, that I'm currently trying to build in a in my train world, um, and they're surprisingly difficult. So I'll probably be working on those. Um, so expect the next episode to be on this one, and that's pretty much 